Okay, guys, so this raid, I'm gonna switch it up a little bit. Every wall I break has to be broken with a torch. So the last hit on the wall to break it, only with a torch. So the unlit torch actually lasts a little bit longer than the lit one, and they both do the same damage, so I'll probably be using the unlit torch. It takes 7,693 torches for a sheet metal wall to get destroyed. So every single thing I destroy, wall or door, last hit on it is gonna be with a torch. Here we go, let's try this. Okay, we'll start with this thing. Sheet metal, only one story on it. Ooh, that heli is close too. I think I'll play it safe here and just go for the front door. It's gonna be kind of difficult getting the torch hit on the last wall every time. So we'll go for the door path. Oh, all right, that actually took a lot longer than I expected. Come on. All right, another door path, but it's going to the right. We'll keep following. Oh no, two doors. Oh, I gotta make sure to hit the right one. I think I'm gonna go for the left door. This one might be a draw box or something. Okay, three doors deep. Oh, another sheet door. Hopefully I'm on the right path. This is a pain in the butt. Oh no. It's zigzagging. So good so far though. Three doors. Four doors actually. Only with torches. Guys, I think I might just drill straight into this back corner. I mean, I think that path might zigzag. And then check this out. There's like a refinery here. And I guess he couldn't put a window on each of these things either. I think that might be the door I'm about to hit right there. So maybe we'll just try this back back corner. See if we can get the loot right here. Oh, let's go. Oh, it's TC too. That only took 200 smacks for one health. That wasn't bad. Captain Nature, come on, you better have stuff. Guess I gotta do this with a torch now. All right, question is, can we get profit here? 25k sulfur, baby. Yeah, that's profit. Let's go. That wasn't too bad. I mean, it was pretty terrible, but not as bad as I thought it was going to be. And we got some pretty decent profit there. I'm going to finish this guy too with a torch. Thank you. That was a lot harder than it looks. Oh my gosh. All right, let's look for another base maybe. Okay, I found another metal base up here on the summit of a snowy mountain. It had ladders on it, but it's good to hit. Stone foundations on sheet wall. In here though, it's armored, armored core. So armored wall takes 60,000 torches, about twice as much as a sheet wall. So I'm hoping I can guess the right one. I'm gonna go straight into the back here and hope we can get lucky. I mean, the door is here. So I think it should be leading around to the back, right here. Yes! Yes, I did not want to have to do that again. Oh, I think that's the first time I ever broke an armored wall with a torch though, in my entire rust career. We got TC, we got sleepers, boxes, everything. Oh, nice! Nine rockets, 1500 ammo. Could check those launchers too. Yep. What kind of rocket is that HV? Instant rocket in there. Put these torches away. I, I'll use the torches for the TC. Oh, it's not locked. Nice, 7k sulfur. That's profit again. These raids are turning into some good profit. Who was it? YMG. Let's go, an auto turret? Can I get in here? Yeah. 
Okay. 200 more sulfur. Some good components too. Five tech trash. And 4k more sulfur. That's good. Nice raid. I'm gonna kill these guys with my torch. <laughs> Alright, two raids. And two pretty decent profit. Coming up on another armored and sheet base. There's a smaller one there in the trees too. Auto turret. Um, this one's pretty well armored though. Sorry, I'm not going to be doing this with a torch. That'd be... Oh, that'd be so exhausting. It's hard enough as it is. I'll take the profits I got from those torch raids and combine with what I had. Let's go ahead and just try to C4 blast this open. It should be a pretty decent raid. He's got a lot of HQM invested. Okay, here's the door armored. I'll use a bit of my explosive ammo and then we'll switch to C4 so won't get countered. Ooh, there's an auto turret in here. So I'll make sure to watch out for that after I break this door. Garage door right there. Okay. Oh, trap. Well, we can break both of these. I think the auto turret's on the left, though. Armored wall there. This is probably the main path, like, zigzagging. And this will probably just be the turret. You know what? Let's just skip this and blow straight into there. Armored. Oh, crap. We'll go in here. Yes, boxes straight into the loot. Hopefully I can get TC though. Dang, nice, five rockets. Okay, we'll blow this out. All right, keep following. Oh, this didn't shoot me for a second. What the heck? But there's a turret there, NTC. And a sleeper I killed. Counter should be coming soon. I can put down a turret as soon as I get this TC. OP loot room. Let's take this TC. Nice, he had an M2 on him. Haha, ha, clan. Holy crap, there's a lot of charcoal. Throw this TC down. And put a turret up. Oh, what is this? Thousand ammo was in this box. Didn't even look in that box yet. Dude, this guy's gonna have a bunch of crap. I can even seal this off too. Be more safe. Wow, yeah. I'm totally safe now. Let's check everything. Looking like he's gonna be loaded. How does he have so much sulfur? Oh, and that's not even the TC. Oh, 16k GP. What? I was not thinking this guy would have this much stuff, yo. Six more C4 and rockets. Nine rockets. M2s! Three more M2s! Yo, this is actually nuts. 65 times three. Over, I think that's over 200,000 sulfur right there. Somebody's here, but he's not getting in. Can make this armor too. I could do a huge raid right now with all this sulfur. Ha, shout out to Ha Ha Clan, man. That is a lot of loot. Another M2. I think that's five M2s. 1400 HQM. 
All right. That just made my way. Thank you. This torch, this freaking lucky torch. I'm bringing a torch on every single raid from now on. <laughs> That's insane.